We just finished meeting with my coach who is going to coach me for my fitness competition that I'm doing in 16 weeks. Uh, yeah, he wants me to get started on Saturday. I'm so excited. We had such a good meeting and he took before and after photos and this is something I've never done before. I've never had a trainer. I've never had someone else come up with my workout plan, my food, just design something for me to reach my goals that I don't have to actually think about or do on my own and I'm so excited to hand it over to someone else and see what he gives me. He's going to be sending me a meal plan tonight. He weighed me and I'm apparently 118 pounds and about 23% body fat. So I think I might ask him to send me the before photos just so that I have them to share. But again, I also don't know what they look like and it's kind of weird because I'm in a bathing suit, but we'll see. My goal right now is to do a figure competition because I think I like that body composition better, but I might end up doing bikini, I'm not sure. <laughs> God, it's free. Last day. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting her healthy stuff. Um, um, this is the last day. So last day continues. We are at Fat Burger. I'm getting a turkey burger with the works. <laughs> Day numero uno, 118 pounds, 20.5% body fat. So I'm on my second meal so far of my new meal plan and just finishing some fish. I won't go into detail too much quite yet about what exactly my plan is because it's gonna be adjusted probably. This is just like the first week, but I actually friggin' live for this. Like I love eating super clean. I love meal planning and I like having everything set out every day. So meal two, day one, super excited about it. I love whitefish. Right now I am back at home and it's already probably 3 o'clock and I'm only on meal 2 of the day. So one thing I am finding is it's hard to eat all of the meals and I have to start earlier. Again, I didn't start till 11 and I had breakfast late, which was meal 1. So meal 2 is just happening now and I still have 4 more. And I didn't get them all eaten yesterday so I'm not sure it's going to happen today. Just running an errand for work. Um, kind of nice that they sent me on a mission, but hopefully I don't get lost. Anyways, I am really excited because I just got my workout plan from my coach, and cardio is being introduced back into my life. Which, weirdly enough, I actually really enjoy cardio. It's my time to really tune out and zone out and. My workout split is gonna be five days and it just seems a lot more simple. Uh, tomorrow I'm actually going to go meet with my coach to go over my workout plan and he's gonna run me through all the moves. It's good to be corrected on my form and stuff like that so I'm excited to do that. And there's also some moves I've never tried and equipment I've never used. So very exciting! Also, it's December and it's not snowing, which makes me also very happy. And I don't even have to do my jacket up. So, winning! I totally got lost. It's 
it's really confusing. <laughs> but now I'm on my way back to work. Where's Wait. Going? I'm doing the thing. Oh. <laughs> uh, we're on our way to go see my coach to go over the workup plan that he made for me, and it is a beautiful sunny day and I have the best partner in the world who just drives me oh, babe. all the way to far away from where we live. Road trip. Um, and <laughs> so we'll find out what he has to say about the plan. It looks pretty good. I'm actually going to be doing a lot less work than I've been doing. Like it'll be less time in the gym but I'm sure it's going to be more intense because that's what he said it was going to be. Whoa it's so sunny. <laughs> all I have to see is your big hand. Hi. Anyways, I'll let you know how it goes. When you have the bestest friends ever and they get you a food scale when they invite you over for dinner. What? And they got me my spinach. There's Frankie. Hey Frankie. And now I posted about it, everybody wants one. Don't eat my spinach. Oh, he's just power button. We should have. Mmm. We're doing all of this. This is my, this is theirs. That was only work on Right now, the department that I work for is having their Christmas lunch, and obviously I can't eat anything that's there, but I did donate towards pizza for everyone, so I'm still technically involved, but I'm just chilling at my desk doing work because I'd rather do that anyways. But I am participating in the Secret Santa, which I didn't do last year, so I'm getting a little more festive, guys. This is my Christmas lunch. Ooh. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Right now, I am trying not to get hit with the car. I'm headed to the grocery store on my break from work to get myself an avocado because I have to have two ounces of that and I don't have any. so. I'm hardcore doing my best to really stick to this meal plan as closely as possible because I know not every day will be perfect. So, getting an avocado. So today is Friday and I started my program a bit late. Officially, I started on December 2nd, which was a Saturday, but I didn't get my workout plan until Monday. So. I'm a bit behind and tomorrow is my mom's birthday celebration and I know I'm not gonna be able to work out for sure tomorrow so I gotta squeeze it in today so today I'm gonna try to do two workouts so I get them all done for week one
So it is Friday night and officially I have finished one week on my new workout plan and diet for my competition and I feel pretty good about it. I'm excited to get started with week two and just be starting on the proper day and you know get all the workouts in properly this time. The one thing that I'm learning um, is that diet's going to play the hugest role in terms of getting me competition ready. Um, consistency in the gym of course is really important but consistency in diet is going to be huge and I'm already kind of experiencing the difficulties with that in terms of being away from the house. I'm going um, to spend a day and a night with my mom and she lives out of town so I'm packing food with me but also have talked to her about what I need to eat so we can of course just go to the grocery store as well and grab whatever I need. So. It's just about really being committed to your goals and not being shy in terms of letting people know how serious you are. I know for me sometimes I feel awkward to be like, oh I can only eat this or I can only eat that and people, uh, I feel like they won't understand what I'm doing and think like, oh you don't need to diet and it's not about that. It's about I have a goal, I have a vision, um, I want to compete as an athlete and there's just, it's a certain process to get there. So. My family's super supportive, my partner's really supportive, my best friend's really supportive, my friends are supportive, so I really have no complaints in that department. And this is my friend Eddie, he's hanging out with me tonight. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna get some sleep now because I love sleep so much. It's definitely in the top five with, all, with working out and food and family and, and Skylar. <laughs> so, um, that's what I'm doing now. I'm gonna go to bed and start off tomorrow officially in week two.